Welcome to Fucked in the Future. And don't forget, we don't hate technology, but it could replace us. So what are we talking about this week? Well, Humai just came out with their new amazing artificial intelligence platform that wants to take our brain and put it into a robot. Now, Josh, the entrepreneur behind this, who I actually know, he's got some great ideas, but he's taken some flack as well. It's just a little bit way out there for most people. Though, I believe ultimately the fundamental idea of being able to transfer our brain or knowledge into some kind of artificial artificial intelligence system is not that far-fetched. It is a long time away. We're talking, you know, 25 to 50 years. What else happened this week? Okay, so MIT released their new mobile uh, uh, artificial intelligence on a chip which is a chip that uh, is specially designed for mobile. It's got very enhanced energy capabilities, so it uses one-tenth of the power of a GPU, which in general terms just means it runs really, really low power, which is great for mobile. So you could start to be seeing mobile technology, artificial intelligence combined very, very soon. Though I did notice the original funding did come from DARPA, so you know, not only mobile phones, but probably drones and and killbots. Uh, We've had some great questions this week. Um, Question from Sam Bailey in New Orleans said, are we gonna have a president in the future? Which is timely given the the crazies we've uh, currently got running. So I would say yes, I think we will continue to have presidents and people to represent humanity. Though I think government will become far more controlled and far more reliant on artificial intelligence to become efficient. So we, we as humans need a spokesperson, so I can see that whole kind of president, you know, maybe we have a, a, a world president that represents us all, um, maybe we will s- stop having these kind of very small-minded countries that uh, um, and uh, borders that really just uh, just serve no purpose apart from uh, restricting people from you know what they want to do. Uh, we had a great qu- question uh, from Danielle Flocko in New Jersey. Who controls artificial intelligence? It's a very good question. The answer is initially it will be the corporations that design the technology. There is no doubt that Apple will put in their own methods and control mechanisms uh, as every other company will. But ultimately, who will control artificial intelligence is probably artificial intelligence. Um, We as a species are extraordinarily bad at controlling anything in a really efficient way. So uh, yeah, we will probably control artificial intelligence with artificial intelligence. And that's this week's Fucked in the Future. As always, please like us on Facebook and Twitter and press the like button somewhere around here. Um, And I will see you next week. Thank you, Internet. Bye.